Welcome back troglodytes to Would You Rock or Not. Today we are looking at a limited edition Les Paul from the mid 2000s sporting the Mardi Gras colors. These guitars are known as the Music Rising series due to the collaboration of Gibson and David Evans, better known as The Edge from U2. Due to Hurricane Katrina and Rita, The Edge and Bob Ezrin, as well as other music industry partners, formed a nonprofit organization called Music Rising. It helped to replace the destroyed instruments from the storms and get the musicians back their guitars. The organization still goes on today, providing similar relief efforts for schools and churches in other areas. Gibson partnered with this organization at its inception by helping create this run of guitars. Only 300 were made, and they were sold exclusively through Guitar Center, with all the proceeds directly supporting the cause. No two of these guitars look alike, since they were all hand-painted. Some are more dominant in certain colors, while others have unique patterns to them. It is definitely interesting to see all the varying paint jobs as they surface to the market. To further the limited edition vibe of this guitar, all of the usual plastic parts, such as the back plate, poker chip, pick guard, and truss rod cover are woods used from the states afflicted by the hurricanes. The pick guard is etched with the Music Rising logo. The backs of the guitars have a rather unfinished look to them, with many stray paint blotches splattered across the guitar in various areas due to the painting technique used. The back of the headstocks are adorned with a handwritten 1 of 300 serial number as well as a traditional serial. The only question left, would you rock a music rising Les Paul or not? Leave your answer down in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you tomorrow on the next episode. Take care.